Ah. struggled to make it to shore through the relentless gunfire, but all 12 of my men fought hard, and six hours later, we safely reached the hills. I shipped overseas to Edinburgh, Scotland. We had to be in good shape, so we trained by walking and hiking with all of our gear. We met our first patients, British soldiers who had been wounded in the North Africa campaign. Treating these men prepared us for what bombs, bullets, and shrapnel can do to the human body. I wrote about what was really going on in North Africa because I thought Americans didn't have an accurate view of the situation. It was not all strawberries and cream. The men and women who served in World War II began their journey on a train like this one. You two are about to embark on an extraordinary journey. Tap your dog tag at the numbered stations to check in with your World War II individual and hear the next chapter of their story. Explore and save featured items you like to your dog tag collection. After your visit, you can access your World War II story, your dog tag collection, and other related items at home by logging into www.dogtagexperience.org with your email address or the number on the front of your dog tag. Let's get started. 
Tap your dog tag to the reader in front of you. To meet the individual, you will be following. Oh, you're in. It's an authentic railcar. It was donated to the museum from the Union Pacific Railways through the Kent Savoy Family Foundation. Now the final scene you're getting ready to see in a monitor on your left is the Brooklyn Rail Yard. Head to the campaign's of Courage Pavilion to continue with the next chapter. Thank you for visiting the National World War II Museum. Finally, in early 1943, the tide of the Battle of the Atlantic dramatically turns in favor of the Allies. New technologies make detecting submarines easier.
Vice Admiral Ozawa. He visits two ships in pursuit of Ozawa, leaving his seventh fleet unprotected. With Halsey's powerful fleet out of the picture, the Japanese Navy races to attack American transport ships filled with thousands of British vessels in Mar Island. Tappy Grip is a small. greatest battle the U.S. Army has ever fought. Not a single soldier in that army had the slightest sense of what was about to happen.
Ay, kompleto, no? Kompleto, nandun. Ah, ini cincin kereta. Ini sah. 